Hey people, Mike Martins here with the Mike Martins channel. Guys, you know what? When I'm putting information out there and I'm trying to get people to wake up to understand what is going on, you're going to have to put a little faith and trust because you can't go somewhere and find it or find some somewhere else. Where's he getting this information from? He's making up stuff for the last, what, 5,000 videos. I've been making up stuff. Because you can't find the information anywhere. Where is he getting this? Just because Joe Rogan didn't say something two hours ago, it doesn't mean it's not going to happen. Okay? Anyways, watch as things progress. I got an email the other day, and I'm going to share it with you, but I have to censor. I'm going to start showing you guys things. Here it is. This email was sent to me. Now, I'm going to tie this to a bunch of videos where I was bashed, threatened, and people were you know, threatening to come and do harm to me. So I'm going to play, I'm going to read this email to you guys so you guys can see the information that I get because the mainstream media and all the science doesn't point to it. It doesn't mean it's not happening. Look at the price of these things. If lettuce is not bad enough, check out the broccoli. Broccoli is a luxury item now. This is how much food cost in Australia now. I have a set, I live in a semi-rural town in the state of New South Wales, far away from Sydney. If this is how much they cost in a rural town, I can't imagine how much they would cost in Sydney where trucks have to drive much further delivery. Okay. I took these photos literally one hour ago from my supermarket in a small country town in New South Wales, Australia. There is the lettuce right there. Lettuce, iceberg, each eight 99. What does it say there? Grown in Australia. Grown in Australia. This doesn't come on a raft from Cambodia. It's grown locally. And there's your broccoli right there. Fresh broccoli. $16.99 per key. There it is. Grown in Australia. So I wanted to... Uh... There's a joke at the bottom here. I went to the bank. Me, I, uh, I love me. I like to apply for a loan, please. Uh, bank, uh, bank clear. Of course, sir. What kind of loan for? What kind? What kind of loan? What kind? What is the loan for? I need some broccoli. Ha ha ha. There you go, guys. Sorry, guys. I'm reading it through a screen here. So what are we even talking about? Just because Joe Rogan didn't say it two years ago, or the View, or any of that shit said it two years. Uh, 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 a few hours ago. It doesn't mean it's not happening, okay? So Canadians can't afford food. Let's go to the one that I want to show here because it's going to tie to Australia right here. This is before they pulled the trigger on the you-know-what that the news has been warning you about, right? Yeah. Australians starving. Power outages to be a regular occurrence in Australia at testing ground. My opinion. Now watch this. Watch this. See my source? Right from Australia. Listen to this. Let me crank it up here. Listen to this. Let me get the volume up here so you could hear this to make sure it's in an English language. Listen to this. Commonwealth Bank customers say they're going hungry days after a massive outage. There you go. Just because Joe Rogan didn't say it two hours ago, it doesn't mean it's not happening. And, it, and Australia is, is a testing ground. I said it seven years ago. Australia will be the testing ground for the rest of the Commonwealth and the blue states of America. So there it is, October 19th. Look at that, before they pulled the trigger on the you-know-what that all the science is telling you. And now banks are referring uh, people to food banks. Banks, banks. So there it is. Banks are now referring people to food bank to help them pay their mortgage in Australia. Look at that. So this, uh, basically, banks are now referring people to the food bank. They will raise interest rates and and foodflation. So foodflation is something we've been talking about on the channel. And then who took this? Who took this video? Who took this video the day after and put it on his report, the Kaiser report? Look at the date it was posted, right there. And the next day, if you go to the Kaiser report and type in that date on August twenty eighth, you'll see us talking about this because we've been talking about this and we've been ahead of the curve, telling people and warning people. Food banks now outnumber McDonald's in Britain. Middle class can't afford food. Food banks notice increase of working poor two years ago. For all your internet sources were telling you everything. Before all your internet sources were telling you to trust the science and trust that. There were people the whole time warning you and telling you. Not because Joe Rogan said so. 
because there's people on the ground that have been telling you for years now. So when you come and tell me, where is he getting this information? I can't find anything. Sit down and wait. You've been warned. Mike Martin's here. I have spoken.